Welcome back today, ladies and gentlemen, to an exciting episode of Factions, where today I haven't recorded Factions in maybe like a week or so, maybe a bit more, maybe a bit less. My, my time telling is awful. But we have been gifted something by Miss AZ Passion, which is similar to last season. Now, if you guys didn't see my last season of Factions, basically there was a group of people leaving me missions called Mission Control, and this woman knows who it is but won't tell me. But we have, if I go to home mission, right, it's in the hotbar. Oh, five seconds, are you kidding me? Come on, a bit faster. We have a brand new Mission Control for season two and look how much more pretty this is look how beautiful it is we have some signs here i actually haven't read these okay i'm gonna just shift my head down for a second but if you guys do enjoy factions make sure you guys do like subscribe if you guys are new let's see if we can smash a thousand likes and let's read this welcome back chief mission control is back stronger than ever missions will be here for you to complete every day ancient missions are the simple one day missions while the divine mission is one time extremely difficult reblow mission boxes for your missions uh here we have our rewards we haven't actually done any missions yet we have our ancient Ancient mission, which is to find an unclaimed base and change the design without them noticing. Now, this is going to be difficult, but this is what we're going to try today. This is what we're going to try to do. I do have an unclaimed base lined up. So guys, make sure you are watching the whole video. Make sure you subscribe because this is actually going to be a lot of fun. Make sure you share it with your friends and your family, your children, your dog, your grandma, your grandparents, your cat, your sister, your, your um, gerbil. And our divine mission is to get one of every spawner, not AFK. So this is actually going to suck. So with the unclaimed base, it doesn't say we can't raid the base. It just says find an unclaimed base and change the design. So I have some invis pots ready. We're going to drink one of these bad boys up. Oh my god, that guy just said, I love your mission control and I might know who it is. All right, I don't want to know yet. This is going to be a big reveal once it actually is. We'll head over to home raid right now in the hot. We know we pressed enter now and we'll go fully no armored. And this is what we're going to do. If you look right down, there's someone right there. It's, this is how easy it is to see Cash Crawford 14 from a relevant faction. And if I F who Cash Crawford, their faction is actually worth $33 million. So we do have base shop, which means we can actually change the design a little bit. Maybe we can do like endstone theme. I actually don't have anything prepared. If we just start digging down I, pretty soon, I think we're going to get in the base. We're pretty much already in it, but we can't. <gasps> okay. Okay. That was easier than I thought. Okay. Let's set a home raid right here. And all we have to do is change the design. I'm also going to raid that spawner because that's free. So all we have to do is change the design. So if we head over to shop, nobody should know that we're actually inside of this base right now. Cash shouldn't know. Nobody else should know. No, but what we do need is some materials. We need some stuff to make it look a bit cooler, make it look maybe a little bit different. We'll grab a little bit of oaked wood. Oak wood, that's the one, not oaked wood. We'll grab a little bit of that. We'll also grab, uh, do we have any stone brick anywhere? Stone brick, are you in decor merchant? No, are you in this guy? Yes, you are, there we go. Okay, so a head slash back now into this base. Oh my God, that, that chicken just fluttered so much. I think I should be able to, oh no, oh dear. Okay, so what we're gonna have to do is slowly change the design a little bit. Maybe what we could do is place some grass along the back here. I don't even think I have a... I think I, I don't have a farm shop or anything I can use, which means I don't know what to do to redesign this base, but we're not actually going to raid all of it today. We're only going to take the little spawner. I think maybe we start right here because as long as I can change the design just a little bit and they don't notice... What's happened to their skin? What has happened? But as long as they don't notice, we should be okay. So what my plan is actually, we're going to dig this out one more just so we can make everything even and hopefully nobody is going to come back and notice we have to be very very careful with this okay like insanely careful and we're gonna have to dig this out one more there we go and honestly this is very very sneaky raiding at the minute because if i mess this up the challenge is over and we have lost which means we don't get our mission control and everything just goes badly but i'm not gonna do that much maybe i'll change just like a little little bit okay we can pick back up the glowstone we just have to hope that this person stays afk and doesn't come back in the base maybe we could stick with the glowstone theme. Uh, if I go raid shop, we should be able to get some glowstone. There we go. I don't have enough money. No way. How am I out of money? We'll sell the gapples. We don't need them. Sell, hand, all. And then we'll go raid shop and we'll buy some glowstone. Oh, I forgot. We don't have basically any money. Okay, so let's put wood here. This one goes here. And if they come back and notice, they are probably going to be very, very surprised. I would be very surprised if I come back and someone had redesigned my base for me. But if we manage to pull this off, I am fantastic, all right? I am an excellent builder. So what they have is they have chests into this wall here. So what we'll do is we'll keep... Oh, I've done this badly, haven't I? No, okay. We're going to stick with what we have. Okay, this is actually getting risky. But please don't be un-AFK anytime soon. Please just stay AFK because if this challenge gets ruined, I don't get my reward. Uh, we also are actually going to raid the base because no one said I can't do that. So I will... Uh-oh. 
Oh dear. They seem to have picked up all the chicken spawners, which now means we might be in a little bit of trouble. Um, I tell you what, out the gesture of goodwill, you can keep the chicken spawners, alright? I'm not gonna be mean today. You can actually keep the chicken spawners if you're watching this video. They are yours. Actually, are they? Do I steal them? I have no idea. If this person comes back and notices their spawners have been mined and that their base is different, it's gonna be a bit of a culture shock, I think. Obviously, this is a raiding server, so I tell you what, I am gonna take them, but obviously, they will not notice it being Raid. Do you have any dirt in these? <gasps> okay, spawners in the chest. We'll take these. Okay, this can be the payoff. I won't raid your base fully. I will, however, take the spawners from the chest. Okay, you actually have stuff I need. You've got glowstone. You've got some dirt and grass, which means we can fill this whole area in. Come on, there we go. Okay, we're doing a fantastic job right now. Obviously, we found some good spawners. Uh, is there anything else worthwhile in any of these chests? There's a salmon. We'll take that. Some diamonds. We'll take those because they will definitely sell for a little bit of money. Their skin seems to be like repeatedly messing up. I'm not exactly sure what that is. Oh, please tell me you have a pickaxe in one of these chests. No, it's silk touch. Regular diamond. There we go, because I can't actually mine coal with silk touch. So what we'll do is we'll do a nice line of stone brick here, and then maybe we can do like a little wood filling here. And this actually has gone fantastically. They haven't noticed. They haven't actually come back to the base. Now, it said you just had to redecorate it unnoticed. It never said I couldn't raid any of it, which is obviously fantastic for me. It means obviously I can go about my raiding ways. And I tell you what, I'm not going to leave, or I'm not going to leave any signs saying that this was me. If they watch the video, then they will know. If they don't, then they will never find out the, the savior that made their base cooler. But this should be enough word for what I want to do. And honestly, this has gone really well. I'm really happy with this. We've actually done a fantastic job. We've redesigned their base. Everything looks so much better than before I came in. It's like an MTV Cribs episode, pretty much. There we go. Everything is now perfectly where it should be. And look how beautiful this is now. All right, everything looks quite nice, quite pretty. We stuck with the glowstone theme. I'm not going to bother doing the roof. I made you like a line of wood. But I don't think we need anything else from here. Cash Crawford, my friend, you really might want to move bases into your claim base because if I F who the faction again, these guys are worth $30 million. All right. He's only a member in the faction, as you guys can see here. But still, you deserve to be in the faction, buddy. All right. You deserve to be in the base with your chickens and you deserve to have fun. All right. So Cash, I'm going to leave you now. Thank you very much for helping me complete this challenge. Let's head back home to home mission in obviously five seconds. Cash, you've been a brilliant sport. Thank you for not moving the entire time and ruining this whole thing. So what we can now do is say, uh, we'll break these signs just, uh, just for the sake of it. Just to obviously get rid of these. Here we go. Unclaimed mission done. And then what we can do is we're going to head back to home vault. And there is actually a funny story about the vault I do have. Miss AZ Passion told me that this vault came from mission control. So it's somebody I know. It's somebody in the faction that they made me this vault. Or I think I stole their vault. But pretty much now it's mine. I've completely stolen it. It's now fully mine. Nobody else can have it. And which means, oh my god, that perfectly timed from our embers coming back. There we go. This is going fantastically. And our spawners now, I think we're going to keep these. I don't see a point of actually putting those in the thing yet. Obviously, once we collect them all, we will. But what I can actually go do, is I'm going to go sell this fish for some money. Because obviously, I've been fishing for a while on the server, and pretty much, we need to sell the fish to make money. That's how you make money. You sell fish. There's no other way. But right now, we have $4,100, which really isn't that much, as I do need to start leveling up as well. So we can sell our deluxe salmon for five thousand uh, dollars we can sell our deluxe fish for three thousand dollars you guys kind of get the idea the more you fish the more money you make on the server and obviously the lower tier fish over here like the normal fish the clown fish and stuff they don't sell for that much but the rarest fish is this legendary divine i need a car it's this legendary silver fish that sells for a million dollars right i might see if i can do a video maybe getting that maybe if we get ourselves something good but we actually made about fourteen thousand dollars which means we can actually now not run Rank up, right? We need $1,500 more. If we head to home vault and we actually go to where the diamonds are stored, we can actually sell those. I lost them. I have no idea where they are. But we'll head to home grind just so we can actually grind up a little bit more money by using cow farms. If you guys don't know, you can kill cows and make so much money. If I even knew where the cows were, um, they have to be here somewhere, right? Someone has to have seen my cows. Cow? Moo. Maybe it's over here. What's over here? Are you cows? Please be cows. You're not cows. What are you? You're a person. But what are you doing? Doing? That's the question. Are you killing cows? No, pigmen. Okay, I'm really far behind. Okay, there's skeleton. We need to find cows. All right, that's what I need. I just need a little bit of money so we can rank up to level two and actually start ranking up properly. Maybe they're up here. That looks like a place you'd grind cows. I will find the cows. I will get them. <laughs> 
Where are cows? I need the cows. There's got to be cows somewhere, please. I don't see... Oh, AZ's going to go get the cows now. Okay, this is actually going fantastically. We've got everything we need. I'll tell you what, I'll be back with you guys once we actually have cows. Hopefully it's soon, otherwise this video will be way shorter than I originally planned. Okay, I said hopefully I don't have to wait that long. Uh, I'm not going to lie to you, it's been two days since that last clip. Right, I'm just going to move my packet of chocolate buttons out the way because I am not obese. Pretty much now, it's at the point where it is a Friday, which means it is perfect for a good old... Oh, I can't spell. For a good old claim perk, which basically, if you guys have a rank on the server, every Friday you do get free charms. It's actually pretty cool. You get it for free. But what we're going to do first is head back over to home mission and double check and see if the rewards have actually been updated for that first mission. If they have, it's going to be fantastic. Um, uh, Let's have a look. I don't think they've updated it. Oh, they have. Okay. We actually do have an update. We don't have an upgraded uh mission, which I hoped we would. But our reward, we have a rigged title, which may mean that it's rigged. Something is rigged. But I'm going to redeem this. Actually, I might give this away next episode, guys. Make sure I found the diamonds. Make sure you guys are obviously liking and subscribing as next video I will be giving away a rigged title for everybody to enjoy. But what we're going to do now is head over to crates and we're actually going to sell all of the stuff. I'm actually curious to see if that person is still living in the souped up base that I gave them. Uh, they might be, they might not be, I'm not sure. But we'll open up a lovely enchanted charm and we are going to sit back and watch the millions come towards me as obviously this is about what's going to happen. I'm going to be a millionaire and then everything's going to be fine. Okay, we got levitating creepers and we also got a set home upgrade. That's actually a chat win as well. So, I mean, I guess we'll take the extra home. Why not? And we'll also open up our two ancient charms. Uh, the first one, we'll speed through. We got some creeper eggs, some TNT and some charm pages. And the second one, we will just open and let it roll. That's what we're going to do. We're just going to let things roll. And hopefully we're going to get a chat win or at least something worthwhile. We're not going to get anything. This is pointless. We got a sword and, and a pickaxe. Oh, it could have been so much better. But guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. <laughs> By the way, guys, you can actually buy my bad line cape at store.badline. It's in the description. It's one of the two. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you guys do like, subscribe if you guys are new, as there, maybe there will be way more factions videos as we find. What dance move should we go for? Let's go for this. This one looks cool. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hope everyone has a fantastic day. Goodbye. Oh my god, default dance.